Good evening, brothers and sisters. Brother Ray here. Um, Fit to Fight for Christ Ministries. I'm here at the gym. I just got finished doing my workout after work. Um, about to head on home, take a shower, get some nourishment, get in my word of God, my Bible, my scriptures, my strength. I just want to go over scripture with you guys today. And I'm talking about 1 uh, Timothy 4 through 8. Chapter 4, verse 8. <clears throat> Train yourselves in godliness for a while. Physical training is of some value in godliness is valuable in every way, holding promise for both the present life and the life to come. I'm going to keep reading for the rest of this. The saying is sure and worthy of full acceptance. For to this end we toil and struggle. Because we have hope instead of the living God, our Savior of all people, especially of those who believe. So when we train, we're training up our physical. We're getting stronger every day. We're eating right, putting that nourishment in. The same thing is with the Word of God. What the Word of God is, but the Word of God is living as well. So what it does is when you study the Word of God, when you get developed in the Word of God, you become stronger as a man of God or a woman of God. So that you'll be able to face the tests that come against you spiritually as well as physically as well. Because when you're led with the Holy Spirit, God will um, indwell in you and give you the power to overcome any adversity that you may face or anything that comes against you. Um, so you do have the power. So once we become heirs to the kingdom, once we become soldiers in the kingdom of Jesus Christ, that we become stronger, not just in physical but spiritual as well. Most people don't have that vision. They don't have the Holy Spirit. But we as believers have that in our in our strength. So when everything becomes rocky, when when the world feels like it's falling apart and all this stuff is happening with the with the pandemic and, and all the things that's going on with the with the economy and the gas and the food, our hope and trust is in the most high God. So we don't have to worry about when we're gonna to have to eat, where we're gonna sleep, because when we are his children, he will always find a way to provide for us and always find a way to take care of us. He will never leave us nor forsake us. So trust and believe that, guys. This brother right here, I love you. I'll just fit the fight for Christ. Stay encouraged, stay strong, stay fit, and keep staying in the word of God. I bless you in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.